चैप्टर थ्री पार्ट ए द बेसिस ऑफ ह्यूमन बिहेवियर एवोल्यूशनरी परस्पेक्टिव द एवोल्यूशनरी परस्पेक्टिव कंसिडर्स हाउ द ह्यूमन हैज मैनेज टू सर्वाइव फॉर सच अ लॉन्ग पीरियड ऑफ टाइम एंड हाउ इट इज बिकम बेटर एज टाइम गोज ऑन This theory considers evolution as a necessary aspect of turning into a stronger human race. The evolutionary perspective was founded by Charles Darwin in 19th century. The evolutionary perspective relates to the way that cognitive behaviors go through the process of natural selection just as the human body has done. This perspective also considers the way that emotions memory perspective and more have been used in history and have evolved in the current era an important determinant of our behavior is the biological structures that we have inherited from our ancestors in the form of developed body and brain human beings also share cultural systems which are varied across human populations thus biological and cultural basis influence human behaviors coming to the biological basis of behavior first number 1 neurons neurons are the basic functional units of the nervous system cells which contain specialized structures to communicate signals there are about 12 billion neurons in the human nervous system neurons have three fundamental components soma dendrites and axon please refer to the diagram below that will help in better understanding so first the soma or the cell body it is the part of neuron that contains its nucleus and other standard cellular structures dendrites these are the multiple thin tree like fibers that branch off from a neuron soma and contains receptor to incoming signals from the new uh, from other neurons the axon is the long tubular structure in a neuron that transmits action potentials and the terminal buttons these are the branching structures at the end of axons that release neurotransmitter next is nerve impulse so nerve impulse is the relaying of a coded signal from a nerve cell to an effector which could be a muscle cell a gland cell or another nerve cell in response to a stimulus it is the means by which a nerve cell communicates with another cell this signal is relayed along the axon of the nerve cell bringing a message that instructor instructs an effector to act the nerve fibers work according to the all or none principle which means that they either respond completely or will not respond at all what is synapse the small gap between the axon of a presynaptic neuron please refer to the diagram here and the dendrites of a postsynaptic neuron information from one neuron flows to another neuron through synapse at the synapse electrical signals are translated into chemical signals in order to cross the gap once on the other side the signal again become electrical so here at this juncture there could be an important exam question which could be that describe how the neurons transmit information so in addition to the text uh, it will also be helpful to draw the diagram of the synapse that would make the answer more descriptive so now we'll see the different nervous system and their relationship with behavior and experience so what is nervous system it is the most complex and most developed of all living creatures nervous system is divided into two parts the central nervous system or cns and peripheral nervous system pns so cns includes brain and spinal cord while pns include all of the nerves that branch out from the brain and spinal cord and extends to the other part of the body including muscles and organs so the peripheral nervous system can be divided into two parts 
somatic nervous system and autonomic nervous system. So soma as we have seen, it means body. So somatic nervous system is the part of the PNS responsible for carrying sensory and motor information to and from the CNS. The somatic nervous system, it consists of two types of nerves, cranial nerves, which are present 12 sets and spinal nerves, which are 31 sets. Cranial nerves, again, are divided into three types, sensory, motor, and mixed. The sensory will collect sensory information from receptors of the head region, and it will carry them to the brain, while the motor nerves will carry motor impulses originating from the brain to the muscles of the head region. While mixed is both sensory and motor fibers, which, which con conduct sensory and motor information to and from the brain. Now, spinal nerves function is to collect the sensory information from all over the body except the head and send them to the spinal cord from where they are carried to the brain. Now, the autonomic nervous system is responsible for regulating involuntary body functions such as blood flow, heartbeat, digestion and breathing. What is involuntary? Invol involuntary means that something which is done without our will. So, the blood flow, heartbeat, heartbeat digestion and breathing, these activities, they happen on their own. And that's why they are called involuntary body functions. Now the ANS or the autonomic nervous system is divided into two, two parts, parasympathetic and sympathetic. The parasympathetic sympathetic system helps in maintaining the normal body functions and conserve physical resources. Once a threat passes, the system will slow the heart rate, it will slow the breathing rate, it will reduce the blood flow to muscles and constrict the pupils. While the sympathetic system, it will prepare the body to expend energy to respond to the environmental threats. When action is needed, the sympathetic system, it will trigger a response by accelerating the heart rate, increasing the breathing rate, boosting the blood flow to the muscle. Now, the central nervous system, it is made up of brain and spinal cord. Protective barriers surround them including bone which is skull and spine and membranous tissue known as meninges. Additionally, the brain and spinal cord is suspended in cerebrospinal fluid. The brain controls body's functions such as sensation, thought, movement, awareness and memory. Surface of the brain is known as the cerebral cortex. In the next video, the part B, we will discuss in details the function of the brain and the rest of the chapter.